Delta went from zero to more than 90% of cases in the UK in 10 weeks. And it's put us in a worse situation by far. It's more infectious, it's more severe, and it's more vaccine resistant. And as COVID is now going through our children, any new mutation that can affect their vaccinated parents and then those parents' peer group will gain a selection advantage, right? It's just a really stupid thing to do to think we can have millions of infections and everything's fine. The government is allowing cases to spiral in the full knowledge that we have safe and highly effective vaccines after two doses. We have the vaccines. It's not inevitable that everybody gets COVID. We know that we have a way out. And the government is not only not strengthening the basic public health measures that we know work, good contact tracing, support for isolation, ventilation, it's planning on removing measures, right? On the 19th of July, no more social distancing, no masks. They're trying to reduce the need to isolate. They're also supporting mass events and the opening of venues such as nightclubs without any kind of testing. We have an excellent vaccination program. We haven't finished it yet. We're not that far from finishing it off, a couple of months maybe, but we haven't finished it yet. So that vaccination program plus better hub big health measures means that we don't need to reach population immunity through infection. We don't need to let millions more people get infected and then live with the consequences of that down the line. But that seems to be the government's plan and it's a terrible plan.